at the grave you will find hope. 1 Peter 1.3 says, Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. According to his great mercy, he has caused us to be born again to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. The resurrection of Jesus Christ gave humanity hope of eternal salvation and a new life. The empty grave gives us reason for hope, for peace and joy. Because Jesus lives, I can live also. The empty grave made the promise of eternal life a reality. Amen. In the midst of where our world is today, fear and hopelessness are rampant. Yet you and I, who have the Holy Ghost living within them, we stand as testimonies of hope and peace. Amen. You know, about many graves, you see the words rest in peace. And you find it in, on tombstones, in, you know, when people write about people that have died. But understand, it is only because the Prince of Peace died and rose again that peace is possible in our lives today and in the life after death. Amen. First Thessalonians brings us hope that our loved ones who have gone on to, to have passed away will rise again. That although their earthly body is in the grave, that is not where they will stay. That when Jesus returns, the Bible says that the graves will be open and the dead in Christ shall rise first. And that is something to rejoice about. That you may not see your loved one again on this earth, but know that when Jesus comes back, and if you are still alive, that they're going to be before you. That they're going to rise in newness of life with him. Amen. 1 Corinthians 15 says this, But if there be no resurrection of the dead, then Christ is not risen. And if Christ be not risen, then our preaching is vain, and your faith is also vain. For if the dead rise not, then is Christ not raised. And if Christ be not raised, your faith is vain. You are still in your sins. Then they also which have fallen asleep in Christ are perished. If in this life only we have hope in Christ, we are of all men most miserable. But now is Christ risen from the dead and become the first fruits of them that slept. For since by man came death, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all die, even so in Christ shall all be made alive. Amen. Because Jesus rose again. The Bible says, I can walk in newness of life. We have been made alive in Jesus this morning. Amen.